What happened to the signers of the Declaration of Independence? Tomorrow is the 4th of July. Five signers were captured by the British as prisoners of war. Twelve had their homes ransacked and burned. Two lost their sons serving in the army. Another two, two captured. Nine of the 56 signers fought and died of wounds or hardships of the Revolutionary War. Carter Braxton of Virginia, a wealthy planter and trader, saw his ship swept from the seas by the British Navy. He sold his home and properties to pay his debt, died in rags. Thomas McKean was so haunted by the British, he was forced to move his family almost constantly. He served in the Congress without pay, and his family was kept in hiding. His possessions were taken from him, and poverty was his reward. Soldiers looted the properties of Ellery, Hall, Clymer, Walton, Gwinnett, Hayward, Rutledge, and Middleton. Francis Lewis had his home and properties destroyed and his wife jailed. Woodrow Wilson once said, We are trying to do a futile thing if we do not know where we came from or what we have been about.